Hello students, in this uh, video we are going to look how to connect uh, your device to community edition of uh, automation anywhere and how to display a simple uh, message using RPAPort. So we are going to see what is community edition, how to access it. Okay, so when you search in community as community edition automation anywhere in Google you can see this link you can click this link see you get this uh, web page type your details first name last name business email phone number okay so all the details and click on get free community edition so you'll get your email to your email ID so I already have this when I click this it goes to my community edition page okay so for you it will prompt you to uh, give your username and password so if you, if you provide that it will be it will take you to this uh, web page okay so the first thing which you have to notice you have to connect your device okay so devices when you click on this devices you can see no devices are being is connected to uh, your uh, community edition so you have to connect this so you can see you should uh, click this option it will show this dialog box on which connect you should click this connect to my computer so it will automatically download a bot agent okay so the first thing which you have to do is you should install this okay so after downloading when you click this it will be it will install so anyone who uses this computer if you click this So finished. So you can click this install bot agent. So it will ask you to enable extension. I enabled it. Get the automation anywhere extension. Add to Chrome. Okay. Add extension. So extension is being added. So the community edition automatically connects to your device and then done. so again if you go to devices you can see your device is being connected okay to your computer sorry your uh, automation anywhere software okay so after that so you can go to automation you can see all the bots which I have created already so for a demo i will show you how to create a new bot so you can see here create new option when you click this bot option will be here if you click that you can give your bot name okay so rpa bot Okay, I'll change this name bot one. Okay, create and edit. Okay, so this is the page on which uh, you have to develop your RPA bot. Okay, so on the left pane you can see variables, the variables and actions so these are the actions which you have to use in your uh, bot okay and finally triggers so i'll explain what uh, what is what are these in the subsequent classes so for the first class 
I will display a message. Okay. So whatever action you want, uh, you can type in this. You can see a message box. So drag and drop. Okay. So on the right side, you can see the properties of the message box. So in this, you can write enter the message. Hello. Okay. So you can choose to close the message box after some seconds automatically or otherwise you can manually close the message box. Okay. So first I uh, will disenable and we will see how it runs. So you have to save and then run. So depending on your uh, computer specifications, your internet connection, it will take some time to deploy and to finally get your output. You can see here the bot is running. Okay, so finally you can see the message from the bot. Hello everyone. Okay. So you have to manually close this. So and your bot has run successfully. So this is our first demo. So when I check this and close after uh, three seconds. Okay. And if I save this, okay, run. Okay, it is deploying to your computer. Okay, you can see the message box displayed the message and automatically closed. So, I hope you would have enjoyed this first demo. Thank you.